Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm Jadwin, and welcome to my stream of Genesis Alpha 1. We're going to do a review and take a look at the game. I just got it today. So, we're going to do a new mission. I did play it for a bit, so I could have a look at it. So, we're going to do a new mission. This is the... We want to do this. This is the game of tutorial, so we're going to run you through the tutorial and then go a little while. We'll play it for a while. Take a good look at it. So start here. Continue. Start our mission. When I was young, our dream was to go to the stars. And so we tried. Give our best. And in the end, we made it into space. We came here to prove our machines, our courage. We came for the competition, to stop for the vanity. Posting. We weren't ready yet. And the dream faded. It became a nightmare. It became propaganda and lies. But soon, our old dream became a global necessity. We needed resources. We needed more space and more food. We needed no, a perspective. After years of digging in the dust of Mars, the inventors gave us wings. The hyperdrive. Our ticket to not only Venus or Jupiter, but to Messier, to Andromeda into a galaxy we call Alpha One. A galaxy full of bright suns and beautiful planets. A galaxy full of life. A new hope. An alliance of powerful corporations was forged and Project Genesis initiated. The dream returned and we became pioneers again. Arcs full of genetic material reached Alpha One. Their goal? Finding a new home for its cargo and to initiate a new genesis for mankind. The best commanders were chosen to lead these starships, and like myself, you are one of them. Welcome to the shipbuilding interface. Here you build and upgrade our ship. Okay, it wants us to build a greenhouse. Yeah, hello. Yep, and I know we do, and we need to build a greenhouse and a tractor beam. Select a greenhouse that happens to be in life support. Greenhouse. This is a greenhouse. The concept of cultivating plants on board of our ship is central to the Genesis project. There is no technology known to us that can effectively store. Okay, we can stick. We can hit the space bar, and it goes where it'll go to a good, a reasonable spot. Different life forms also demand different biosphere components to survive on this ship. To compose a certain biosphere, we need special. So we're products. building the greenhouse. Superior genetics cloning technology is not configured okay. for the creation or reproduction of plants. Watch us do a tractor beam. This means that happens to be in our farming, believe it or not. Shipwrecks. Our tractor beam module is a fast way to acquire already refined materials. I think I'm a materials. I think I want to put it behind. We're gonna get lost. No deposit and no refinery required. Now we can begin our journey. Okay, we can rename the ship. I can't name. Well, we can name our crew members and stuff. I didn't see a way to rename myself. So. I happen to be in Canada, so it's going to be HMS, and we're going to name it Jadwin. Why not? Okay. I have a storage of 32 out of 40, a cap, a crew of 4 out of 5. I can't, so we'll start the game. Basically. Or rename ship. That's done. Start. Okay, that's done. Return to building. We've completed those objectives. So we can get it. No, 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 no. We don't want to do that. So tab. So right now I can go to systems. We've already put that on. So. No, I don't want to do that. No. Uh, why are we locked in here? Uh, da -da. Okay, so we can move up and down. We can go around, look at our ship. 
we put our stuff on right there. Space travel. The tap. Start the game. There we go. It's a new game, so I still have a lot to figure out. Okay, my name is Pac. I didn't figure out there may be a way to rename myself. Okay, so Pac became the cat, and he's a clone. So we're going to follow the tutorial. Okay, I can just press the right mouse button to get out of that. So he's going to say, first thing we're going to do is we'll talk Welcome to this to the bridge, one. Captain. Here you can find the Galaxy Terminal, Hyperdrive Control, and Computer Mainframe. Use the Galaxy Terminal to set travel destinations. Simple, quick. I've got a gun. One, two, nothing on my three, four button. And then this is the harvesting. I just hit my right mouse button, it does the harvesting. So I do have a gun. Like I said, there's a turret goes on when we get... So, so we can go to T. Greetings, Commander. You have been sent to Quadrant Alpha-1. The mission is to find a new home for the crew on board of this ship. Expand your ship and explore the galaxy for resources and interesting new life forms. Look out for a suitable planet, a Genesis candidate, and when you are ready, initiate a Genesis. Alright, this has got some amazing graphics so far. And it's simple control. It took a bit to get used to because we play in certain types of games. So it wants us to go to our tractor beam. Alright, I made a pretty quick shot. Greenhouse, through our greenhouse, tractor beam. <laughs> okay. Go to trace. So we'll just do this guy. So it wants us to scan debris systems, tractor beam terminal to reveal debris resources. You can also scan planets, however, uh, only debris can be found with the tractor beam. Okay. So we get back out of that. Let's the talk to this guy. The Alpha is full of shipwrecks. Our tractor beam module is a fast way to acquire already refined materials. Materials will be directly moved to the ship storage. No deposit and no refinery required. Okay. So he disappears. We can't do anything with that right now, but we do need to come over here, and it's going to do a scan, so... We have resources there. And right now it's beaming that debris on board. So I can S to exit. But if I can increase that, Remember, I only have four crews. So we put one in here. Now a crew member is going to come here and run this. All right. So that will help it go faster. Now I can come here personally and hold the E button and increase this. Resource beaming complete. Okay. So I have the capability of making this faster. Oh, I fell in my own little hole here. And then I can do it again, various different places. And then I don't, I only think all I'm doing is it, it makes me help. Resource so I see one, two, three different terminals. I got him, boy, he's basically running that one. Okay, he's got that one going, but I can speed it up. So now it wants us to go to shipbuilding tab. So we go to tab. Welcome to the shipbuilding interface. Here you build and upgrade our ship. Modules can also be deconstructed if you're not satisfied with their layout. Yeah, so or if you have other reasons to destroy them. Also, so I recommend using this interface for orientation on board by accessing the ship map. Okay, so what it wants us to do right now is can, workshop can be found in defenses. Workshop. This is a workshop module. Here we research Q and construct weapons. And E defenses. to turn it around. You can also configure the weapon racks with your favorite. Space bar makes an weapons. attachment. Assign engineers to the workshop in order to speed up research processes. 
and then I build. This is basically a modular building system. And then we tab out of it. Okay? Now it wants me to go to the workshop. Well, I just put it off the... I just put it right off... Right next to this. So you want to use the terminal. Uh, it needs us to assign a crew Java member. Sign. And S to exit. Take a turret, okay? So it wants us to do this. And a turret, right there. Okay, turret is on my three key now. That wants us to go to our... This room here. And find a spot to stick it. Well, I'm thinking right about... Probably right there. So we press the feet. And then find a spot and press the left mouse button. Now the turret is active. Go to the greenhouse and prove your biosphere, okay? So, greenhouse is pretty... Ah, I keep falling in there. So, it wants us to go to one of our terminals. Plant a tree. Okay. So, did, I didn't want, didn't want me to use that. This term. is a greenhouse. The concept of cultivating plants on board of our ship is central to the Genesis project. There is no technology known to us that can effectively store or even provide a vital biosphere for the full time of our endeavor. Different life forms also demand different biosphere components to survive on this ship. To compose a certain biosphere, we need special plants. Superior genetics cloning technology is not configured for the creation or reproduction of plants. This means that we need to protect our plants at all costs. And he disappears. So, this is where it wanted us to go. So we go to this terminal. It wants me to plant a plant. So we have plants. Palm tree. Plant Processing. one. And I should assign Job a crew to assigned. take care of it. There's three of my four crew gone. Okay. Now it wants us to make a cloning lab. Resource acquired. Okay, so back to our building menu. Crew clone lab. I put that on crew that crew side. Created and added to the crew. So I'm thinking Thanks about layout, but I'm not that's about technology. the same size. We are also able to combine human DNA with DNA we collect in outer space. This feature gives us the amazing option to create perfectly specialized beings for the Genesis program. I don't think I'm going to put it there. Okay. And then tab to get out of the build. Now it wants me to go to the clone lab. But, but we, So we've got that pretty set up. It's right off our tractor beam where everything's coming in at. I figure since all our stuff is coming in here, we'll do it here off of here. So we use the terminal, and we go to clones, human, and we get the clone Cloning one. Initiated. Resources collected. Now we don't have a lot of choices right now. Then we're In our cloning laboratories, new clones can be created and added to the crew. Thanks to superior genetics advanced technologies, we are also able to combine human DNA with DNA we collect in outer space. This feature gives us the amazing option to create perfectly specialized beings for the Genesis program. Honestly, this is a pretty fast moving game. Now I can come here and do the same thing I did before. I can press the E button and as long as I got it, it'll speed it up. So it's basically done. And we can come here and watch our clone be born. Now it wants us to build a hangar, okay? But we're going to talk to our clone first. They don't have much to say so far that I've been able to figure out. This one's name is Kozel. I have the capability of renaming him. Alright, so here's how I'm going to do this during my streams. Not tonight. you got to come back. This may be a review, but I'm going to continue to game on streams. And you need to go to the website at the top of the pay, top of the screen right there and check my gaming schedule.
and find out when I am going to stream. I will put it on the schedule sometime this weekend. So basically, you need to check my website come Sunday night or Monday, sometime Monday, and find out what day I'm choosing to put Genesis Alpha 1 on a weekly streaming schedule. And we'll see how far we can take it. This is early access. I bought the game. It was not given to me. And I want to play it and see how it goes. So we'll see how far the content can take us. And we will play it to the content's done. Resources and collected. then I will kind of... I'll figure something out to, get, to give people their names. So that's how I'm going to do it. And we will continue. So, so far, this is a quick review today so far. So we're not going to rename him. So I can S out of this, and he's going to go to work. Now it wants us to build a hangar. This is the tutorial telling you how to get started, kind of. Basically, that's what it is. Okay, the hangar is in our farming resources. I don't know if that's where I'd put it, but... No, that's not... Yeah, there's a hangar. This is our hangar module. The hangar is necessary to acquire resources, plants, or other interesting things from planets and shipwrecks. Yeah, that looks good. You need to assign pilots to operate. We're getting hangar. longer, but we're, we're opening up spots. for additional information. Okay. So now it wants us to go to the hangar. So we're in our clone lab, back to our tractor beam. And I put the hangar on the back end. Okay. This is our hangar module. The hangar is necessary to acquire resources, plants, or other interesting things from planets and shipwrecks. You need to assign pilots to operate a hangar. Please use the hangar terminal for additional information. Okay, it looks like that's done. So we can basically come right here, go into here. I've just made a new crew member, right? So Genesis. now I got another one. And let's see, we don't know what's there. We don't really know what's there. So I'll go there. Destinations resource acquired. And then S to exit. And look at our crew member coming along. And now it's telling me to join the expedition. Nine, launch, eight, activate seven, six, five, four, three, this is where we can get some of our health back if we get hurt. Zero. Shut the door. Right mouse button, I can start getting resources. Like that. Okay, then and my crew member is gonna do the same thing. be getting attacked. Okay, we've got at least we got looks like we got stabilized. Okay, that's the bu that's basically some clone sampling. I can go look around because the ship has got a gun, and the ship has been shooting some stuff. There's some more, so we'll go around and collect clone stuff where the ship has been shooting them. And. 
And um, basically I can go collect resources again. And collect resources till we're full. Oh, there's some bile. And we got some more clone samples. Cool. Life form detected. Where is it at? Okay, my health is good. Oh, they got way in on in on us. It's kind of hard to see some stuff. We'll see. I'm gonna, we're gonna harvest till we're full, and I'm gonna get a notice that we're full shortly. Harvest are full. There's no reason to stay here now. Other than I can take. Oh! I would say we are ready to go home. Return to mothership. And um yeah, let's go home. Nine launch seat seven, six, five, four. Just in case they come in while we're shutting up. One zero. That's a little bright. I mean that that planet was a little awkward to see in, but that's fine. So we've returned to the ship, and then we can go to T, our planet expedition. Now it wants us to build a ship's refinery. Okay. So we're going to go tab. We'll back up a bit. Ship's refinery. Okay, so farming. A refinery. This is the refinery. It's real small. Raw materials will be enhanced here. Okay, this it's pretty small. This takes time. To increase refining speed, assign so engineers I'm thinking to maybe the right refinery. It, oh, it'll go right there. Yep, yeah, looks like that's... It might connect to that. It's hard to say. I'm just seeing if there's any... There's So we could do it off of there, or we could do it off the... Okay. I think right there. Now we have a refinery that's going to be off our hangar. And then we tab out of that. We're in the hangar. Renew refinery. This is the refinery. Raw materials will be enhanced here. This process takes time. To increase refining speed, assign engineers to work in the refinery. <coughs> Alright, so we got fine. I think we have one more crew member. Job assigned. Okay. So what I can do to help out is go to this terminal. I think that was not that one. There's a terminal here I can help out with. I think. Maybe not. Well, here comes the crew member. Oh, 
Oh, maybe. So I can pick. Currently refining iron. So it's actually dealing on some of the stuff that we got. I guess off of the ships. So it wants me to refine materials. So we do iron. That's what it's currently doing. Waiting for resources. And hopefully a little robot's going to be bringing them. Preparing next process. I can't speed anything up here. Apparently. There comes the robot. See it? There it goes. Look at that. So it's taking a break, I guess. So now I might be able to do something. Ah, so now I can speed it up. New materials have been refined. Okay. On the bridge to travel to another planet. Okay, I can come into here. It's waiting for sulfur. So the, the crew member's running this automatically. Okay. I don't know if we've gained enough biomaterials and stuff. So it's preparing for the process. That's your refinery. So we're probably going to see a robot come in with the materials when it gets them. Because we brought back quite a bit of sulfur. So it wants me to go to the bridge. Tractor beam, greenhouse, straight through. We got somebody running it. And the bridge. So I, I, I did something specifically this time. Then we can load it into here. We're up here. Okay. Perform a hyper jump it wants us to do. So I can zoom into here. We've got various spots right around us it wants us to check out. We haven't even checked all the planets here. But it says we've got two of the five planets done. So basically, basically we would have to come back to finish the planets. But it wants us to perform the hyper jump to finish the tutorial. And I can S out of that. So we can see what happens. New materials have been refined. Okay, that's different. That's all right. Congratulations. Good job. Okay. So I always got a gun in my hand, apparently. Um, I haven't even looked at this one. That's a merchant's and that's okay. So that's a merchant trader. So we can scan for debris. Speed up the scanning. So it's scary. I kind of need to. I don't know if I got a. I, do I have one crew member left? No, I don't even have a crew member left. So there's nobody going to run this but me, I guess, until we can get another crew member. And they scan. Okay, and then we're basically. What we need to do now is go back to the. So, the, oh, let's take a look. There's our quarters. Survival guide updated. Open a PDA, press the T. Your ship is like an ark, and the crew is the most important part of your endeavor. No crew, no genesis. Improve the crew's DNA and treat them properly, and they will grant success of your mission. Each crew member needs a crew New materials have been refined. Where they can become sick. Assign crew members to modules to maximize the module's functionality. If you die, you will respawn as one of them, with all of your abilities and flaws included. As long as crew members are alive, so are you. Okay. So let's check some of this out. There's our Genesis mission information. Basically, with Captain's stats, I, hurt, I got hurt a little bit. The survival guide. Space to there farming. Are shipwrecks in this area of space. You can gather refined materials with our tractor beam. Select space debris at the tractor beam's terminal. Wait for the materials to arrive on the ship. 
Ready your weapons. Aggressive life forms could emerge from the loot. Okay, so that was the reason I needed they wanted me to put a weapon there. Alpha One is a dangerous quadrant. Even the bravest pioneers will need top tier weapons and defenses to survive this endeavor and to lead the Genesis mission to success. In the workshop modules, you can research powerful weapons, search the galaxy for new weapon samples, and stock up your arsenal. Assign your favorite gun to the weapon racks. The racks will make the weapons available in several spots on board the ship. Okay, biosphere? The ship must provide a proper biosphere for the crew. Different species need different biosphere components to survive. New materials have Collect been refined. plants from the planets and grow them in greenhouses. To compose the right biosphere for your crew, protect your greenhouses from alien threats at all costs. No plants, no life. Assign gardeners and build greenhouses to optimize the biosphere. Okay, cloning. To increase or specialize the crew, you must clone new members using the clone back laboratories. My the better the lab, the more advanced your clones can become. If you find valuable alien DNA, you can enhance the crew further. Collect biomass and alien DNA from dead creatures with your collector. Build a biomass tank and store biomass for your cloning activities. Okay. Feel free to experiment with DNA and alien abilities to maximize crew efficiency. So basically keep them, as hu keep them human, it sounds like. Planet increase farming? increase the size of the ship and to forge weapons, we need to gather resources. In the current quadrant, we have identified more than 300 planets that we can explore and harvest. Select a planet at the hangar terminal. Send the harvester to the planet and wait for its return, or join the expedition. Carrier robots will then move raw material from the hangar to the deposit, and from there to the refinery. Refined materials will be stored in storage modules. New materials have been refined. Okay, so we can play with the coloring. I already renamed it. I can't, I didn't figure out if I, how to rename my own character because I get cloned. But so I just named my ship. U.S. HMS Jadwin, because I happen to be in Canada, so I figured that would work. Okay, so if you happen to be new to my ch channel, watching me on Twitch and Mixer, please punch that follow button, help my channels grow, I'd appreciate it. And if you're new watching me on YouTube, please punch that subscribe button and help those channels grow. Let's see what our guy has to crew say over quarters. here. Each crew member needs a slot in one of these modules. If a crew member is sick or feels bad, you can most likely find them here. Okay. So I guess they have their own little spot. Okay. I haven't figured out what that does yet. It hasn't done anything for us. Call IDA. Oh, we can bring it. I don't know what we're doing. Okay. Crew quarters. Oh, we Each can bring it back. Crew okay. Needs a slot in one of these modules. If a crew member is sick or feels bad, you can most likely find them here. Yeah, because that would be this one. Oh, wow. So that's, I guess those are considered the slots, so... Because there's our bio tank. And this is where they store a lot of that stuff. We haven't done anything there. So let's see what All this one says. All biomass you collect will be stored here. Make sure we always have enough biomass in stock, and biomass tanks ready. Biomass is the basic material for every cloning procedure. Cool. So, we're at that point. Basically got a depository. It doesn't look like there's... Oh, we got one in here. Welcome to the deposit module. Raw materials from the hangar will be moved here by carrier robots. Make sure that we always have enough deposit space available. Otherwise, the carrier robots will leave farmed raw materials in the hangar, and further harvesting will not be possible. So we could use this. Ships resources, weapons resources, travel, plants. Okay. So we get some capabilities there. 
and this is mother storage so we can call this one Let's see what it is. this is the refined storage module production ready materials leave the refinery and will be stored here keep an eye on our refined storage capacity if we run out of space the refining process will be placed on hold our refined materials are the source for shipbuilding, weapon, and ammunition supply. Okay, so we need to we can go L shift, and that brings up some command controls, which we'll have to look at as time goes by. So we look at the quarters, the bridge is that way, our greenhouse is this way, we put the storage there. There's nothing on that side. We got a crew member assigned to our greenhouse. Nothing on either side. We're straight back into a tractor beam. And then we can come here, see what they're doing. There's debris there. Eight iron, 12 iron. That's got fungus. So that's probably the one we went to. And it had uranium ore. We don't know what's there. We don't know what's there. So I'm thinking we ought to go check out another planet. Basically, I get to choose, I get the lots from the hangar bay. Okay? But we could choose this, which is basically more iron, and tell them to start getting that. And this guy will work on it. We got the gun to protect them in case they get some nasty stuff. We have a workshop. So we have some options here can build a laser pistol, laser rifle, defenses. You see me build the turret. Energy barrier when place creates an energy field that blocks enemies and their projectiles. Durability. Okay. I could build another robot if I had the materials. And then we have energy cells for ammunition. They take lithium. Okay. And this guy basically does his does what he's told to I guess or he just keeps things stocked up this is where we got that Access turret connected. from and that would be energy Access cells and this is the guns I'm carrying mine and so unless we upgrade I can't get the next gun I could take another turret and put it down in the area to protect them I'm curious if I could put it down. We had a turret on top of our ship, so I'm wondering if, we have, if I took another turret, would it help? Did we collect enough biomass to do something with the clone? Alien abilities. So we haven't really got any of that. We got some crawl DNA. 20. Clone samples. Basically, we need 10 and 20 and 2. We got some arachnid. We got some human, but it looks like we need 17 and we've only got five. Okay. So, I think we got to go play around. And that's them. So, what happens, I guess, that gun is protecting is when something gets teleported in here or tractored in. So, we go to the hangar. Something just get in. I guess something got in here. Do I need to come by and collect it like I did the other stuff? So it looks like the turret did its job. There should be a set of numbers I was able to see before. Here it is. So it shot 50 bullets because I think it had 600. Okay. So I can come here. And we were we went there, so that had fungus and uranium. Let's go there because we don't know. So let's go help our trooper. And then space bar to activate. Okay. Uranium. Okay. 
Ready now. I don't know what we got, but that was a big box. Apparently. So our troop, our, our, our clone is, that we brought along with us is collecting resources and fighting as well. Basically, I just need to look around, do this kind of stuff, and just collect any of the DNA that showed up. And then find myself another thing to mine until we do this to a full. Hopefully. What's that? Accessing archives. Oh, interesting. 20%. 40 percent. 60 percent. Oh, I don't know if I need to do this. 80 percent. I won't do it for the last hundred. All phases complete. All right. So what do we get here? We intercepted a transmission. Please check your data pad for details. I will, but not out here. So they want you to get out and explore. You have a limited area because it looks like I have a boundary. Okay. And I'm just, I'm not even hitting the shift key. While she's, while she's collecting, I'm out looking around to see... So I don't have to do anything. They just need I just need to be in the vicinity of it. And then I basically have to keep an eye out for think critters coming after me. So not a bad thing. 60%. So the way I'm gonna do this is I am gonna name people following watching me on Twitch, Mixer, and YouTube. I'll come up with some way to pick them by by All next week. Complete. So what you need to do is Go to my website, which is listed above, if you're interested in watching more. Okay, this is a suit upgrade, so I'll, have to, I'll go through that. And uh, find out when I am going to stream. I haven't scheduled this. this was a, I bought the game. The game is not available on Steam. It had to come off of a different site, but I got access to the game. I had to buy it. And I want to stream it and play it for a while. We'll see how far we can get. So I did play it for a bit to get the hang of it. And then I decided I'm going to stream it. So this was my review. The graphics are great. The concept is pretty good. It's running a little different than a lot of other games. It's not. It's semi-survival, kind of. Or pretty much survival, but... We have a limited area when we land on a planet, from what I see. I think they need to cut some of that down. That's a little bright. But I don't see any more for us to mine. I think we got everything. Oh, there's one. Oh, harvester's full, so there's nothing for us to mine. She mined everything. Or he mined it. I don't know if I got a male or a female. Um, don't know. Felon. I have no idea. Well, we could talk to Felon. Species Felon, human. Doesn't tell me male or female. We can rename them. So that's the reason I'm saying that. Is I'll figure a way to and raffle off the names or something. And anybody watching it, when I stream it, will get their names. If they win, we'll take over one of my clones. So watch us do that. We turn to ship. Nine, launch, eight, seven, six. 
one. Yeah, they need zero. to. They need to. That needs to be calmed down. That's a little too much. All right. So now you got these hard. These guys are going to go to work, and she's just going to do business here. Resources collected. So I have to check around the sh ship at times. Because it looks like we've had a couple attacks, maybe. Okay. How many bullets you still got? So no, that must have been from the first attack. So he's just running everything we scan and he's trying to get a hold of it. I, so everything I guess I collect is now gone. So let's go to T. Because we need to check out what we just got. Tom's voyage. Trajectory deviations. Major Thomas Phelps speaking. Speaking very well. How's the transmission getting through? This is a glorious day for mankind. trained all my life for this moment. May God, may science be with us to make this endeavor a success. May this day be remembered as a turning point for humanity. May Alpha One welcome this ship and this crew with open arms. So where are these energy nodes they're talking about? Security is lousy on this ship. So do I need another turret? Oh. I'm gonna go get another turret and put it out here. I think. Uh workshop, yep. Access granted. And we're going to have to see what we can build. So it looks like we kind of need a turret here. Get that side. We're really going to need, it looks like we're going to need another one. Because it was talking about nodes, so I'm not sure what we got to fix. Energy. Resources collected. Okay. So it looks like we could use another turret to be put right here to protect this side. But we'll kind of walk around and see if we could if anything was left laying around. So it doesn't look like they do it. New I found materials have been refined. Okay. Let's go to the workshop. What have I gotten collected? Defenses, turrets. We can construct a couple. Processing. Processing. Can queue it up, okay. Weapons. Laser pistol. Laser rifle. X-ray caster unknown. So I basically got more weapon samples are required, okay. Resource acquired. So we can and then they'll put, the, as far as I understand, it's, when it's said done, it's going to appear here. E to equip and reload. Okay. There. Okay, that's what I got to do. I got to have the weapon that I need loaded. I never used the gun. I use this one the most. So that basically loads us up. So we got various different ammos. And we got another turret. So, and there'll be another one coming. I want to increase the hangar's turrets. So three. Have been refined. And put one right here. Now the turret, the hangar has two turrets, that, which should protect it pretty well. Because it looks like critters got out of here. Resource beaming complete. And they're coming through that Resources. to get in here. So it's possible we probably need to set up another turret. Maybe 
I don't know where. I mean, that was a good spot because it covered a lot of area. Guess we could set up a kind of a turret right here in front of this. We did make another turret. And then there's the greenhouse, which seems to be doing all right. Can we plant another plant? Okay, we got no plants. But looks like we got some good stuff growing. We've got one planter done. And I've got a crew member assigned. Um, to get more crew members, we need materials. Resource acquired. So we, we're getting iron, basically out of that. That's our storage, the greenhouse. And the way I built it was straight back. So we have some more connection points right here and on the other side. Right here. So there's, there's connection points for us to grow right there. New materials have been refined. Workshops on this side. Clone chambers on this side. If we can come check and see if something's changed. So we don't still don't have a, enough biomass, it looks like. Twenty or twenty, but we need more samples, I guess. Ballast adaptive. Okay, why can't I? Cl oh, I don't. Oh, the reason why I can't is I have to build some more crew clothers. So they do tell you. See, there's refinery. We can zone in our workshop, our tractor beam, and then our hangar. There's the greenhouse. There's quarters there. There's a bio tank there. Okay. So I'm thinking of crew quarters. Crew quarters. Each crew member needs a slot in one of these modules. Q and E moves if them crew around. Is sick or feels bad. You can most likely find them here. Or I don't have enough materials. Oh, I need more iron. It looks like, or more energy. Crew cabin five. Okay, it got somewhere else it'll go. So if I got it right, it looks like what I have on hand is on the left side maybe. And what I need is on the right. It's kinda hard to say. Because I'm hitting the space bar and it won't it won't dock. And I'm going back here. So I'm going to say I don't have the materials for it. Okay, connections. We've already got all that. Defenses. We got the workshop. Life systems. Greenhouse reactor. Crew. Farming. Connections. Acts. Oh, we can build our own connections. Okay. And okay, and the connections up. This module grants access to the service tunnels of the ship. Make sure that you always have enough access. The corridor connects modules and is available in different designs. Make sure you balance the ship's layout between security and efficiency. Okay, but nothing's gonna, nothing's locking there. Again, I I need one energy or what it maybe 27 energy, and I only have one, I guess maybe I'm not sure, but nothing is locking into place. Bio tanks. Okay, so what's going on here? Deposit. Refinery. Quarters. I purposely built it this way to get space to do it, I thought. I'm going to say I don't have enough materials. Because those are actual spots. And we got connections. OK. 
Okay, that's just not connecting. Access. Because space, it says snap to space. Snap to next connection. So it's not snapping, which means either I don't have enough energy or something like that. Okay. So we can come back in, we can look at the tractor beam. So let's go back to the bridge and scan. Or workshop. Let's see. Okay, so we have a rack. That. I can remove from the weapons rack. Okay, so basically they're just in the rack. I mean, I'm carrying it seems like all the time right here. Access granted. And there's another, there's a, the extra weapon turret. I'm not sure where we should put that yet. Not sure what these are. Did I talk to this one before? This is a workshop module. Here, we research and construct weapons and defenses. You can also configure the weapon racks with your favorite selection of weapons. Assign engineers to the workshop in okay. order to speed up research processes. So... Energy barrier, I can construct that. Needs three of five, okay. A robo thing needs five of nine. Energy cells need one of five. So the first one I'm thinking is what we have, or what, what it requires, and the green and the green is what we have. Okay. Trying to figure this out. So I guess the only other thing we could do is go back to another planet. So we know that's got uranium. That's got fungus. Let's go check this one out. And I just gotta get on. And we've done just over an hour. Uh, the graphics are good. The concept looks pretty good. I figured out what to do for on this on the last one. Lithium this time. I think they need to work on those lights. They're a little too much, I think. Life form detected. Okay, where? lithium but we had an orange one over here I saw an orange or something looked like orange Life form detected. That. that's iron They don't seem to be too nasty right now. We'll let her do the mining. We're going to go look around, see if we find something like we did before. I just got the W key, and they run, it runs around pretty quick. I'm not doing a shift key or anything like that. I mean, this is early access. The graphics are pretty simple, but pretty good. Accessing archives. Life 
phases complete. So basically I gotta shoot them. So it warned me where I'm at that I had life forms. Okay, not a bad thing. Hopefully she's still alive or he's still alive. I don't know. Male or female or how that works on this. I knew I could choose them. I mean, we can get iron from the teleportation uh, tractor beams. So I think we should definitely get lithium. Luckily, I'll just do a quick run around. Yeah, there they are. That's iron. I don't see a. We, can, we we tend to get enough of that. So I say go after lithium till we're full. Cause she'll keep mining while I run around. Let's put it that way. We did this one, but I need to pick we that up. T. So our base is those transmission we looked at below. Okay. So let's just take a good trip around here. We can only go so far. Life form detected. Where? Okay, our harvester's full, but I was just looking for the life forms. So we need to run around and do our collection, make sure that we got everything, because she does, whoever, crew member doesn't do it for us. Guns do a pretty good job, so I bet you if I bring a turret with me, I can put them on the ground. And then pick them up, maybe. I think we might have gotten it all. So I gotta come here. So there's my health. I'm full. I did alright. Then I can do this, and then I can go launch his back. I can go S in case they come into our ship. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Zero. So basically what we're trying to do now is just get materials. So we brought a whole harvester load. Right there, like there. And now these guys, the robots will pick them up, take them to be refined. Okay, and they'll take it into refinery. And he'll just do his business. So what I gotta figure out is how I can I think we got we got two guns in here. So this should protect that. I don't know what I don't know if the critter sh this one was shooting at. Um came from off the ship after we landed. Or if they got I thought I seen a little bit of blue under there. Or if they got loose out of here. Okay, he had issues here. It's 475, so he's had critters show up. So how do I reload you? Eat it. I could pick it up. Okay, so if I take a turret with me, it's got ammo in it, I could probably put it down there. Okay, that's looking f reasonable. 
I can't do a clone till I can make a clone chamber. I mean, to quarters. It says I need three. I got 27 energy, so why can't I... Oh, it will snap. That's what I wanted it to do. Okay, so finally we got enough, apparently. Alright. And if I go this way again, now I don't have enough. But we can clone now. Okay, that's going to give us the crew quarters to make another, if we got the biomass for it. Yeah. Cloning so initiated. We can just let that go. We can exit out, or like we did before, I can come over to the terminal. That's for me to heal, or them to heal, I guess. We come over to the terminal, and we can, I can increase it. I just hold down the E, and we get the clone. Okay, so if I, I don't know if I can assign another one as a pilot yet, but it's getting done, and we will be able to name, the, like I said, we're going to name this, I'm going to, I'm going to name of people following once I figure out how I'm going to do that, so all you need to do is go to www.jadowin.com and check out my streaming schedule. And I wouldn't do that till Sunday, or, or basically not till Sunday. Okay, and then from there I will, I will put it up, and you'll know what day I'm going to stream. And if you decide you want to watch more of Genesis Alpha One gameplay, you'll know what day I'm going to stream, what time I'm going to stream it, and if you can make it to watch it, that's great. But however, I will also keep names available for my YouTube channel. So I'll figure some way out to name that too because all my streams are available on my YouTube channel as well. I ensure they are there. They are only good on Twitch and Mixer for 14 days. So I'll set something up and put up the rules, look at the post for the stream, and work on it. So I'm thinking assign another one here maybe. So we can get some more harvesting Jones. done. That's got iron. That's still got iron. And we still got uranium there. For more uranium and lithium. Or we can move on. Can I make another clone? I made enough house. Oh, we have enough. Cloning initiated. Cloning and you can queue them up. Okay, so we can queue up three of them. Okay, so we're using up our biomass. We are going to have to go chasing more. Resources collected. Okay. I'm just looking. I haven't checked everything out. So I'm presuming this is maybe the bodies of who we're cloning. I'm guessing. I could speed it up, but I think we'll let this run its course. So we put a second person here, so this is working this stuff faster. The next... I don't think we need a second one in here. Because unless I... I presume he just keeps things ammo up. And then I have to do this, and that's how I load this. I presume, I guess, I'm guessing right now, okay, I'm going to pick that turret up. If I have to go pick this other turret up, maybe? Okay, it's got lower ammo, so three. Oh, I'm seeing now, I've got to go maybe ammo it up. Or maybe it has its lifespan. Hey. What's going on? Here? New materials are being found. We 
You got something climbing around? I guess we're done. Oh, right. Th somebody got it. So we've given them two turrets. Our hangar bay now has two turrets. If we got enough materials, I think I'll clone up. I'll we'll do two more. Oh, we should do a bit. We can't. Let's Processing. construct a barrier and find out what that is. Let's construct Processing. another turret. And Resources. let's construct an extra robot and see what they do. I don't know what the barrier I'm guessing I put the barrier over doors, maybe? And these have to be something, eventually. So that would be special ammo or something? That'll be the energy barrier. So four. I'd put it here maybe? New materials have been oh! Defined. It does. Okay, that's what it does. It blocks doors. Can I go through? And we can go through it. Okay. Interesting. And then I can pick it up. So we can do four. And I can put it right there. Okay. So my clone lab's a little better protected that way. I'm getting lots of nasty stuff, guys. Resource beaming complete. Resource acquired. But they're collecting stuff. And that's actual DNA or something. So they don't collect any of that. Okay. So he's still, he's good. I want to, I think I want to install one more into here to run the farm. If, if it's available. So they're not up yet. Okay, well, I'm not seeing any. Ah! They look a little hard to get to. So they're not doing any damage to our ship by shooting. Oh, there it is. So they got it. Clone sample racked in 9 of 10. Looks like. So we're getting them. So if I go back to the first planet, we might get our first cloning capability, because I think that's where we got most of the arachnids. So that's out. That's out. What's well, got four left? So we can go back here. Okay, so we're getting there. We, I mean, we got another clone channel. We've got a couple more clones on the way. Again, I'm going to let her do most of the mining for right now. I'm guessing we came down into a new position. So running around. Okay, we're at the end of the map right there. Oh, you're leaving the harvest shield. Okay, can I go out of... Oh, I can go out, but it's... It will kill me. Okay. Interesting. Is 
So I'm guessing maybe we land in a different place every time? But it didn't show much resources left. But I'm not finding anything else. Search unlocked. Ah, see, we got the arachnid now. Back to mining that like I was doing. Guess I need to take a sweep around. Life form detected. Make sure we've gotten all the biomass we can get. Collected plant fungus. So is there something I can actually get like that? Or am I missing something? Well, they're coming after me. gotta keep sweep. I can shoot at him, let her do the mining, and I kinda sweep. Pick up the DNA. Still in a starting area, so it looks like we're basically just getting little stuff, but we're getting stuff. So we get we got a barrier awareness nine to ten. I want to do some more. I want a chance at getting more. Still got ammo. Supposed to take my back, girl or guy, I don't know. We're not full yet.
Facility research added. Okay. So this means I can work with them for the next clones I build. I don't have much ammo left. We're just trying to get it finished. I don't want to go back without a full load if I can help it. Okay, now we're full. So let's get out of here. So I can go to here and he heal up. And then I can go to here and... Now I'm curious to see what we got go, come out of this. So I made us another, we did make another robot, so there's two in here. I don't know if the clone came up. Let's check this out. Arachnid is full. Abilities. I can, we can research it now, so now I need somebody in here. Okay, we're going to have to ask, we're going to have to quick bring somebody out of, alive. Okay, because I think they, they, I think they make it slow, and I have to process, I have to speed it up. New clone has been welcomed. Uh, the barrier, I put the barrier up here to protect it. So use the terminal, assign a crew member to it, and then go research. Research an alien species now. So we're going to see what they can do because we got enough samples to get to that point. And in the process, see the cloning's gotten speeded up. So my other clones are going to come out. Resources collected. And um, I'm thinking I'm going to assign one more to research. Well, no. We got two clones, so one to farming and one to research. Because I didn't put a second one in the farming. And see what it does for us in the farm. New clone arrived. Now, let's see. Now, let's go one to farming and one to the ship. Resource beaming. Okay, so we're going to go to the greenhouse. And then I'm going to... Resource gonna acquired. Assign a new crew member to it to help take care of it. Job assigned. Okay. And then what I want to do next is go to yeah, the tractor beam. We're not going to put another one there. New materials have been refined. Because we're doing good on the... Ref I could... There. But we want to go to the hangar and I want to see if I can assign another one to the hangar. And we take two people with us. Okay, I guess not. That's out. That's out. So right now... So it looks like we can't... Oh, the other one's not ready yet, I'm guessing. Okay, what do we got here? The creature's DNA improves intelligence and speed, but weakens health. Adding this DNA is good for engineers. Okay. Somebody I'm not going to take with me. From the looks of it. So basically, I would say my guy in, in the clone lab and the workshop is who I would add it to. So not bad. Well, um, tell you what, I want to thank you for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed it. It was a first look. I, I find it to be a very, a fairly fast-paced game. I, I got it today. I played it for, I played the tutorial real quick, and then I, I got everything set up for me to do a live stream of it. So this is my this is what I my take on the game. It's got good New graphics. Have been they're they're pretty good. The UIs they seem to be doing what they're told to do. When the creatures came in, they went shooting them. And they finally got them between them and the 
the guns. My trooper I was taking with me seemed to be doing pretty good. Okay, I got one, uh, you know, instead of taking one with us, I should probably put, put one more in the refinery, maybe. I'll think about that. But if we got the materials, we might be able to clone two more people. We can go look at this. Because what it said, remember, is arachnid, alien abilities. Or clones. Arachnid clone. We can't do it. A crawl clone. But a human clone, we don't have enough stuff yet. Okay? So I don't, I, I'm not positive about everything yet, whether it's that's from what I'm the thing I've collected or is it from what the farm is doing okay because if we got because we should have one more clone I put that clone in here okay so there's two in here running the farm new materials have been refined I put one in the clone chamber we have two in here I'm still curious to see once I get another clone if it's there can I? I can't. Well, if, if I can, I can't do it. Resource locations. We know there's iron. That's all gone. These we have to launch and go to the harvest ourselves. Okay. And then. So it, it's giving you some interesting. It's giving you some combat, which isn't too bad so far, I, I, I think. The turret gets rid of quite a bit for you. And I took a bit of damage, and I seen that one take damage and heal up. My clone. Their respawn idea is if I get killed, I come back and I with all my abilities and I take one of their places. Not a bad concept. The workshop is pretty simple, but I think we have to do some more capabilities. Alright. We don't have an, so I need to get another one in here maybe for research. It says I need more weapon samples. Defenses, we've got a turret and a barrier. I did build that robot, and then you've got ammunition. So it looks like it's got the stuff, and you have the capabilities of talking to these. Oh, set his, oh, set up weapons rack. Construct robots so I can give him his. have been refined. Okay, so I can rename him, and we can get, it looks like we might be able to get a little more specific with him. But he kind of just does what, I queue stuff up, but he does it, from what I see. Access granted. And then I have to load up the weapon I want. So I need to tell him to make some ammo, probably. I haven't been using that. Oh, what's this? That looks like the same thing. It's got 59 shots in it. So that must be the girl's gun, maybe? So if we go into weapons, I can tell him to make another... Oh, uh, remove from weapons rack. Remove from weapons rack. Okay, so that must be... And then add to weapons rack, and then add to... That's removable. Remove, remove. Okay. We don't know anything about that yet. Defenses, turret, energy barrier. I can construct Process. another energy barrier. And I could throw in another robot, probably. Processing. And I could do that, and we could construct up Processing. a whole bunch of energy. And then that takes up everything we've got right now. So we'll let that do its business. It'll do its business Access. when I come back. That's a turret. Oh, I wanted to take that with me next time we go to the ground. I want to take that and put it out there and see what happens. So, I want to thank you for watching. And, like I said, go to my website. Check it out. And, um, look, take a look at my schedule. By, by Monday night, by, by Sunday night, I will have chosen what day of the week and what time I am going to stream. Genesis Alpha 1 and from there on people watching it 
will have a chance to get uh, one of my clones with their name on it. And I'll do I'll probably do one per stream. And then there'll be a second chance when I have it in mind, a second chance if you watch it on my YouTube channel. Twitch and Mixer, watching them on Twitch and Mixer are not eligible. The reason why is you watch it on my YouTube channel, you can leave a comment that will answer what I'm going to do something specifically in the stream that you will have to do on my YouTube channel to get your character, get your name taken one of my character, one of my clone names. That's basically what I want to do. So I hope you enjoyed it. You have a great night, and I, like I said, you follow, you're watching me on Twitch Mixer. Please punch that follow button, help those channels grow. And if you're watching this on YouTube, please punch that subscribe button and help those channels grow. I would appreciate it. So you have a great night, and I will see you in the next stream. Goodbye.